So I wanted to show an additional stretch you can do for people in their shoulder blades, their upper back. The first two videos dealt with the border along the shoulder blade, the vertebral border. Then we dealt with levator scapula. I want to deal with something that stretches the traps, the trapezius, and also the rhomboids. What I will do is I have the receiver in front of me. I will have them cross their arms over their front. And holding on to their arms, I can gently place my knee in their back, maybe to one side along the spine. Nothing very heavy. I'm grabbing at the wrists. I have the receiver take a big in-breath. And as they exhale, I'm gently pulling their arms. to get a stretch to the front. So when I'm pulling, their arms are crossing and it's stretching this musculature and pulling the shoulder blades apart. If you have them do this one time with the right arm on top, you'll then reverse and have them put the other arm on top. I can switch sides if I want through the knee. Big in breath. And exhale. Pull and squeeze. You'll notice that the elbows are below the shoulders. If I get the elbows too high, it feels like a little bit of a jam in the shoulder joint. The other option that you have that I use with clients um, is a little bit more intimate. There's more body contact between the giver and the receiver. If you are good friends with the people of the party, this would probably work. But I wanted to show you that option with the knee on one side or the other. And keep in mind that there wasn't a lot of pressure there. It was more to stabilize. What I will do is I actually kneel, and I put my body up against the receiver. And then I have them cross their arms. And just like before, big in breath. And exhale. But this time, their body can lean back into mine. And I can pull. Again, that's getting a stretch through the rhomboids that connect along the vertebral border of the shoulder blade. And it's also stretching the trapezius by rounding just a little bit through the upper back. We'll see you again soon on RobertGardnerWellness.com.